happy Monday and a happy start of a brand new job for me. Um, <laughs> strange, this is the first new job I've had in quite a while, so it's a little nerve-wracking and I have to go into the physical office. I, you know, have to set everything up. I don't know how anything works there, so I'm a little nervous. Cleaning up my purse from my old job first. I'm gonna double check to see again how long it's gonna take there, even though <sighs> I've already checked like three times last night, but I can never be too certain. Um, let's see here. I'm like hunched. Ugh, I'm just so not ready. <laughs> it feels like the first day of school where you don't know anybody. And it's so strange. And I don't like this. I usually don't get nervous for things like this. And yet here I am, nervous as I'll get out. Okay, so it's going to be about 40-ish minutes to get there. Um... The strange thing is, is they didn't tell me what time to be there at this morning. What am I doing? Okay, 40 minutes, got it. Gotta leave here by 8 10. We can do that. Okay, I'm gonna finish my coffee, try to relax, try to think positive thoughts, and go from there. This is so strange because usually around this time is when I would be walking Lucy, my dog. And now I'm walking to get on transit to go to work. Honestly, it feels like I'm going back to school because it is the exact same route I would take to school but half the time. the 10 minutes and not really care, but so sad to see it go. The train was late, so now I am late, even though technically I don't have the start time that was given to me. I was hoping to get here by 9, and it is 9.02, and I'm like a block away. <clears throat> We're just gonna go with it. The plants need sun or the light that I'm using for this. So we're keeping them here. Because I don't, didn't get anything while I was working. I thought maybe I would do a what's in my work bag. Granted, this is likely going to change once um, I'm more established in the role right now. Literally first day, just learning, lay it off the land there and uh, yeah, so. <laughs> anyway, so this is, my purse, uh, day one. <laughs> um, I think this is just like a random Nordstrom purse, don't know, uh, but it is black hole in here. So whatever just, somehow everything fits in. So first couple of things, like I said, I stopped at Trader Joe's, needed basil for a recipe, and then needed snacks to have at work, which for some reason I didn't buy while I was at the grocery store yesterday, but you know, now we have it. Then I just have my wallet, uh, my empty lunch <laughs> container. I, let's see, I have, my passport because I did all the i9 stuff. I have my Kindle which I didn't even end up reading on my commute. Um, I have I went from having a 10 minute walk from home to work to a 40 minute uh, public transit ride slash walk so we need entertainment. My glasses, which I forgot to wear today, and why I got a migraine, but that's fine. Yes, my dog did chew on the case, but it works, and that's all we care about. My notepad, I like these. Um, they're just post-it notes lined, so then I can take notes on a case and then just plop it right onto the case file. So for example, 
today I was making notes for a case that isn't in the system that I have access to yet. So I just made them on here, tore it off, stuck it on the file, and now it's stuck on there. Why did I bring these home? I don't know. <laughs> they were supposed to stay at the office. I uh, Laptop charger, not interesting. An extra mask, uh, just you never know when you accidentally forget one. Hair tie, phone charger, hand sanitizer, lip balm, or not chapstick, it's aqua for much better than lip gloss, chapstick, anything. It just like actually hydrates your lips and sticks. Uh, in Minnesota during our winters, very dry, very needed, also very good on cuticles. And then just a little tiny rubber band for the hair. And then I brought my planner, which every year I buy a paper planner with the hope that I will actually use a paper planner. And every year I don't. This year has not been much different, although we're only on day 17, so who knows? Uh, I guess the next big thing, laptop, work laptop. Even though I'm working in the office, I still prefer to take my work laptops home just in case I have some extra time or if I have things that I wanna follow up with, um, I can easily do that at home. Here we have one of these rapid hydration powders. Yes, I understand that this is just sugar water, but no matter how much water I drink, I'm still always thirsty, which reminds me, drink water. And sometimes just adding salt isn't it, so I carry this. Why did I need to explain that? I don't know. Carry my medication because I always tend to forget it, so I split it in half and make sure I always have some on hand. I have a blue and black pen. My vaccine card, I have that. I also have the digital one, but for some reason I can't get my booster onto the digital, so I just carry that. Gum. Tylenol, which any worker will tell you is your best friend, or just any pain reliever is your best friend like today when I forgot to wear my glasses and gave myself a migraine and that's it oh wait wait a minute oh <laughs> um my bar card which I don't really know like in what instances I'm going to have to show this considering that everything is stored online and you can literally look up anybody's uh bar info online but you know, I just carry it anyway. Oh, and these are my um, previous law firm's business cards. Um, I still keep them in here because it's only been one day. And that is that. That is everything that is in my purse. Uh, I guess missing headphones or earphones, but I was wearing those on the transit home, so they're in my pocket. Hopefully this added something more to this. It'll be interesting to see how my bag changes um, once I actually have hearings. So what I'll hopefully and mainly be doing here at this new law firm is I will be uh, focusing on immigration and doing a lot of uh, immigration uh, removal defense. So that means I have to go to court and what, <laughs> what you bring into a federal building should not be this junk because you do have to go through metal detectors and screening and if you have a bag this full it's going to take them some time to dig through so usually at least when I interned at the court I would bring the bare necessities yeah this is just you know to keep me comfy keep me happy and I don't know how to end this portion <laughs> this grown adult is using the MySpace okay. angles uh <laughs> is going to have Cocoa Rice Krispies to celebrate a good first day of a new job and close off this video montage, whatever, um, talking about my very first day at a new job since graduating law school. If you stumble upon this video and enjoy 
content regarding law school, practice of law, general millennial lawyer things, etc., and really bad camera angles. Stay tuned or go watch other videos. There should be something here or maybe here. I don't know how YouTube works yet, aside from watching it.